so uh, we shall uh, learn about uh, 8 bit data addition using 8085 microprocessor so to write an alp to add two 8 bit numbers stored at consecutive memory locations this is our aim so our algorithm is first we have to initialize a memory pointer to data location okay in all the programs you need uh, this statement where you initialize a memory pointer to the data location then the get the first number from memory in accumulator then the third algorithm is get the second number and add it to the accumulator and finally store the answer at the memory location uh, at some other uh, memory location so if you look at the flow chart first start then you will enter the value 0 into the C register C register is for carry and you are going to uh, initialize it with a zero value and then the HL pair register it is a general purpose register you are going to load the memory location 4500 H is for hexadecimal number into that uh, so this is 16 bit so H register which is 8 bit and uh, L register which is 8 bit so 16 bit uh, uh, memory uh, address and you are loading 4500 uh, address into it then the memory uh, which uh, uh, which gets the first input value is stored into the accumulator and then you are incrementing the HL pair register HL plus 1 then again you are going to get the second number to the memory because you have incremented the address now it is 4501 uh, and you are adding it to the accumulator value which is the first number and you are adding it and the result is stored again in the accumulator so you got the result here in the accumulator now if there is a carry you have to uh, increment the uh, carry okay c plus 1 or if there is no carry you have to bypass this statement and go to uh, the HL pair register and increment it and next you have to store those values uh, so the accumulator value which has the output is stored into the memory location new memory location and then you are incrementing the HL pair register and storing the carry uh, if there is carry or if there is not uh, no carry at all you are going to increment it you are going to store it in the new memory location so this is your opcode uh, or you have to generate the opcode you have the mnemonics here MVI stands for uh, move immediate 8 bit. Here you are going to 8 bit immediately into the register C. Then MOV is copy from source to destination. You are going to copy the input data into the accumulator. LXI stands for loading the HL pair with 4500 H. You are initializing the HL register or you are going to load the HL pair register with the address 4500. Then incrementing INX is increment register pair by 1. H is incremented by 1 that's why INX H is given. Then memory second data is stored to the memory register B. Then you are adding A and B and storing it in A. And now here you have to be very careful. Uh, jump if no carry if there is no carry at all you have to you should not increment C so you are going to jump the statement and you have to go here so for that here you should in the program you have to enter the address of the statement storing the value and you have to enter here so initially you have to give some other memory location and then you can take this memory location and paste it here uh, then your uh, uh, copying the value of the uh, register C into accumulator and then you are going to store it in 4201 memory address and finally you are going to halt the program so this is your GNU uh, simulator 8085 now I have uh, entered the programs as it is MVIC 00H uh, register clearing the register then initializing LXI 
then you can go here at the keypad and you can just keep your cursor there over the button so sta store accumulator direct so you are storing the accumulator directly into the memory location accumulator value is directly stored into this memory location which is 4503 and 4502 and your input data is at 4500 remember you are loading the program at 4100H hexadecimal number why not at 0000 yes you can do it but we are following in our uh, uh, record notebook uh, we are loading all the programs at 4100 so we will follow that uh, or if you are very confident you can choose some other memory location too I don't have any problem with that so now uh, jump if, if there is no carry I have written the address as it is 410DH but actually I have given some other address which is 40 uh, say uh, 4001 okay some memory address then you go to the assembler and assemble it so zero program assembled successfully you have received this sort of message go to show listing and if you press show listing you will get okay so now the address is 1004 uh, 1004 it has to be 4100H you have to give 4100H if you don't give H it will go to some other value so now you go and show the listing now you can see 4100 and at the store uh, at the direct at the accumulator you get 410D is a memory location so you have to copy this and put it here 4100D it has to jump here 410D okay this is your opcode 4100 you have 0e 41100 then 41022 21 4103 00 4104 and 405 7e 678 likewise it goes on now i'm going to the memory i'm going to enter the input data 4500 H. enter so you have 4500 you are going to give the input data 5 and 4501 is the next number you're going to give the input data 8 something like that so you are given the input data 5 and 8 you are going to add these two 8 plus 5 13 now I am going to execute the program 4100H I have uh, uh, I have to change the address to run the loop 410D 410 so I am storing it at 4502 which is the third memory location and the fourth memory location then I am hold 100H executing the program so you can see I have added 8 plus 5 and store value is 13 13 is stored this is 8 bit addition using 8085 microprocessor thank you